Are we there yet? What? Are we there yet? I already told you no! Don't make me turn us around and go home! Are we seriously going to freeze to death on Christmas? According to my GPS, the Christmas Lodge is still pretty far out there. Well, if we gotta die, at least it's pretty metal. Hey guys! If you keep running, you'll stay warmer! Knuckles! Uh, why are you guys here, freezing to death on my roof? You should know. We've got the Christmas episode of Ask the Sonic Heroes to record. And you're supposed to be in it! We thought you'd be there by now. Look, just come inside and get warm, and we can record at my place instead. What the heck is Sonic? Is Sonic dead? Nope! Still alive! But I think my face is frozen to the ground! Everybody. My name is Rouge the Bat, and welcome to the 43rd or whatever episode of Ask the Sonic Heroes! <laughs> Amazing start! And this is my handsome co-host, Shadow the Hedgehog. Hello, I am devilishly handsome. Today, we'll be interviewing Team Sonic. Say hello, boys! Hey everybody, Sonic the Hedgehog here! Hi, it's Tails! Nice to see you guys again! Hey guys, Knuckles the Echidna here! If you'd like to ask questions uh, to the show, uh, just wait for us to put a question submissions video out so you'll find it in your subscriptions box. It's real easy. It looks like this. Um, yeah. And you can ask your questions. Quit there. adding me what my favorite donut is. I don't care unless it's in the question. I'm that pretty people sure. want to know. Well, if anyone's curious, my favorite is chocolate with sprinkles, but we're not asking me, no are we? No asked you. <laughs> I know. I was just saying nobody asked me. I enjoy a good plain ring donut. Bit of maybe a bit of flour sprinkled on top. Look, the the, the best the best kind are the, the just original glazed ones. Come on. They have this new berry powdered one at Duncan, and it's pretty good, but it's very messy. <laughs> I've never had. Well, if a I Duncan was answering this person's question, which I'm not, I would get a I'd get like a chocolate cake donut with raspberry filling. Ooh. Wow. Okay, Guys, that actually I'm, I'm gonna. Hungry. Anyway, the episode that we were filming. <laughs> Yeah, the episode. Uh, before we get any dumber, let's go ahead and start our <laughs> episode proper. All right, Faker, let's begin. All right, Faker. Questions 1 through 30. Give me number 16. To Sonic. What was it like having you your gotta own fighting You got to read the name. name. When Sonic the... Ah! Ah! Been a while, I'm in shadow. <laughs> oh, no. The Lancaster Kid asks, To Sonic... What was it like having your own fighting game when Sonic the Fighters first came out? Also, whatever happened to Bark, Fang, Bean, and Honey? Did Sega forget about them? You know, it was really exciting. Virtua Fire was out at the time, too. I was a really big fan of that, and seeing that we got our own fighting game? So cool. Was that like pre-Smash Bros? Oh, yeah. Well, Smash was like, wasn't it like 1998 or so? Browsing yeah. Google at the speed of sound. <laughs> Got places to go. Got data I need to know. I would guess Sonic the Fighters is 96. Smash 1 was 98. I found the date. It's 1996. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I told Shadow you! was right. Well, uh, I don't know where Bark, Fang, Bean, and Honey really are. When was the last time we saw Fang? Sonic Mania? Yeah, he Work too. Well, you an saw illusion. a vision of him. In yeah, Mania. an illusion of him tried to beat you up. Yeah, but that still proves that Sega hasn't forgotten. That just means he's still around somewhere, right? Yeah, the only one we don't really know about is Honey. I don't think we've seen Honey since. Yeah, I thought she wasn't even technically released. I thought it was like. Nah, she's not. Yeah, she's she's in the remake. Well, the yeah, the she pool. got the cut from the original one. She was just in the data of the original. She like actually wasn't playable. All right, all right. Thank you, Sonic. Uh, Tails, why don't you pick a number one to thirty? Twenty nine. From Missing Wyatt to Tails, a Miles. So Metal Sonic has been uh, getting in the way of you guys so many times, but you always seem to leave him for Eggman to collect. Have you thought about taking him back to the lab to reprogram the egg out of him? Hmm. Short answer, yes. 
long answer, I probably shouldn't do that because it's dangerous. <laughs> um, <laughs> What's the worst that could happen, Tails? Normal bots, normal egg pawns and things like that aren't an issue because their tech isn't as crazy, like, detailed, I guess is a good word. But, like, things with crazy AI, like metal, I, uh, it would be fine to work on it, but not with the pre-programming it already has. That makes me a little scared. <laughs> he does have his own personality, so... Right, it's It'd probably just, ever come to programming. Yeah, yeah, like, definitely want to re look into his programming. I've, like, it's been very interesting and in the back of my mind for a long time, but... There's just too much risk involved, I think. Okay, probably better that's not fair do enough. It. Knuckles, questions 1 through 30. Select one. 25. A story seeker asks... Two Knuckles. Hey, Knuckles, are you and Rouge finally dating officially? Oh. <laughs> you two seem to be getting quite close lately. The biggest reason I ask is the Christmas moment you two had after she sang her own rendition of Santa Baby to you, <laughs> and you gave her a nickname after. So please, just <laughs> give it up and admit it already. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, hey, gonna wiggle out of this one. Yeah, the nickname, right. Rougey poo. Ugh. Okay, let yeah. me set a record. Good for the record, that's a terrible. And yeah, that, <laughs> that was the point he called. <laughs> he, tried. he said that as a joke. That wasn't like an actual affectionate nickname. It was so I would stop calling him <laughs> Nucky all the time because he thinks that sounds weird. I mean, it sounds better than Rougey poo. <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> I wouldn't say that we're dating, but we are hanging out from time to time. Although there are certain times where she tries to steal. A master emerald. Still. I've got to keep you on your toes, Naki. Otherwise, you'll get rusty at your defenses. You know, you could just say hi. Well, that's not gonna that that's not gonna help you with your security systems, now is it? That's pretty sus, Rooch. <laughs> Knuckles, what did you think of the Santa Baby song I sang for you? I'm blocking I, this out of my memory. I enjoyed it. It, it was a nice song, and I actually do appreciate it. See, I don't always annoy him. Hashtag ship it. Anyway, moving on. <laughs> oh, All right, Rouge. Let's ask them a group question. Okay. Uh, Sonic, you can uh, be the first one. So why don't you pick a number 1 to 30? Give us number 12. From It's Dust to everyone, are you guys excited about the Sonic 2 movie? And if so, what do you guys want to see the most? Me! Me! The answer is me. Me! I want to see me. We all want to see each other. It's simple as that. But, you know, I am excited to see uh, Eggman finally get a bit bigger, you know? Get more round, become more of an egg. Th that being teased at the end of the first movie, it's like, <gasps> oh, he's looking more classic now. I'm looking forward to seeing that in the next movie. <laughs> I'm just waiting for the third movie so I can show up. I don't know, they'll put you in that soon. What? Who else w What's the third movie gonna be then, if, if not me? Here's a couple things for you. We saw how, like, Sonic had such a controversial first design. So by the time the first uh. Sonic movie came out, he looked adorable. And then Tails followed suit and looked very cute too in his uh, I look so good. So I when look so Tyson Hess. So when uh, when it was revealed what Knuckles' design looked like, what did you guys think? Like especially you Knuckles, uh, what did you think when your design was revealed at least in the models? I look amazing. Yo, Knuckles looks jacked. I he do. does, but like in a good way. Yeah. <laughs> I like Like, this. not boom jacks, he looks but. tough, but not like super buff, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I like this. Look how thick his arms are. It looks great. I'm excited. Hey, Knuckles, Knuckles, did you see this yeah. one? Did you see this one? What the hell? Um. <laughs> I, 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 Knuckles! I, I, I have questions. Oh, I look worse. <laughs> I look worse. <laughs> my head. I was going to complain about my legs, but yeah, Knuckles don't got no body. They need to give me eyelids. What is wrong? <laughs> I you need got no eyebrows. eyebrows. <laughs> Wait, Tails, your hair is gone. What happened to my head? <laughs> horrible haircut and your eyebrows burned off. <laughs> Uh, and just another workshop incident. <laughs> you look the best. You can be quiet. <laughs> I mean, but my legs, though. You look like you have to pee. <laughs> you do. 
I just I can't, I can't get over the look on Knuckles' face. He looked so upset. Thank you. <laughs> These are amazing pictures, Rouge. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. I thought I'd, uh, I thought I'd show the uh, the photos we've got from behind the scenes. <laughs> All right. So overall, you guys are look most looking forward to Sonic Two movie. Just the chance to get to see each other. Yeah. Yeah, yep. it's gonna be so good. And Eggman. Who's with you, Eggman? He yeah, apparently him. I don't know. Well, I mean, don't you want to see him look more like the classic Eggman? No. <laughs> okay, fair enough. The echidna is fair enough. <laughs> Arcana IX to Sonic. The other day I was browsing fanfics when I saw a fic with Eggman X Your Mom as the main ship. How would you react if that actually happened? <laughs> what? <laughs> oh. You, you, you said you wanted to see him. Hey, I, I need to sit down. I need to sit down. <laughs> Uh, moving on. What happened uh, to the speed round, Sonic? Come on, you gotta answer the question. You answer your question. I haven't gotten one yet. Then move it on. That's not an answer. I can no longer run. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that feeling when your worst enemy becomes your dad. Tails, pick a number, one to five. One, number one. From Candy Cane 7802 when you spend all that time in your workshop tinkering, do you ever have anything on in the background while you work for background noise? Whether it be music, a podcast, a TV show, and if so, what is usually playing? My favorite thing to listen to are nature podcasts, like just talking about um, different kinds of species and just interesting stuff about them and stuff. It's really fun, because then I learn stuff at the same time. Knuckles. Number five. Carl Jackson asks, How did you become as strong as you are today? Is it all natural born strength, or do you have a serious hardcore workout schedule? I try to keep myself busy and lifting boulders and stuff like that, doing some treks around the mountain and whatnot, so I do have a pretty tense workout schedule. Look at these swole arms! Knuckles got guns! Yeah! He's jacked! <laughs> Two! <laughs> Four! <laughs> From Magenta Murgoat to Team Sonic, please sing the refrain of We Can from Sonic Heroes. Unlike our theme, what? this machine, which totally slaps, We Can is kind of boring. Look, it's the power of teamwork and friendship. It's our bond. We can make it if we all stick together. We won't give up, not ever. And everything's gonna be alright We all bring out the best things in each other Together we are stronger than anyone else could be on their own So much better than alone Oh boy! Put a little extra time on that clock Cause it's time for a surprise bonus round! Spin the wheel for a holiday themed speed round question, boys! This thing looks suspiciously like the wheel of smooches. Just spin it! Okay, okay, here we go! Maya Abraham asks, you are able to get one gift for Christmas, and it can be literally anything. The only problem is that Eggman will receive double of what you ask for. What do you get? I would really want an endless chili dog. Like, what's Eggman gonna do with that? What the heck happens if you get double, double of an endless. endless chili dog? It's a new source of infinite power. <laughs> get out of here, Master Emerald. Give it a spin, Tails. Oh, no. From the Unjolly Snowman, if Santa were to give you a job as his personal toy maker, would you be up to the task? Absolutely. I would make the coolest toys ever. Like, I already have so many ideas. I mean, who wouldn't be excited to work with Santa? Yeah! My answer is yes. <laughs> Knuckles. Yes. Octoon2 asks, What did you get the Master Emerald for Christmas? I don't really think it wants anything but peace. Looks like you're gonna have to find a way to box up peace on Earth. If only. <laughs> Last spin for the group. Alrighty. 
From Alan Carrillo, to everyone, how would you use your abilities to build a snowman? And Sonic can't just mention his speed. He needs to refer to another of his abilities. I punch it! Oh, Somehow okay. I'm not surprised. <laughs> Digging the snow, building it up, and then punching it to make the shape. I know what I'm doing. An ice attractive base? And because it had the ice base, it would stay totally, um, snowy all the time. Wouldn't that be cool? Yeah. I would spin dash to gather up a whole bunch of snow. From there, all it is just, uh, shaping it from there. The pile's already there, so no need to worry about anything else. Good work, boys. Good work. Let's get back to the regular speed round questions now. Go, go, go! Sonic 5. Mr. Terminator 3010 asks, Do you know the exchange rate on rings to Mushroom Kingdom coins? I've tried looking it up, but I can't find a consistent answer. I don't know how much this is. <laughs> I don't know what this is worth. Is it worth more than ours because our money has a hole in the middle? Oh, stop! <laughs> no! <laughs> I don't think so. More so because I think there's more coins than there are rings. And this guy doesn't know money. He doesn't even have a house. <laughs> Tails, next question. No, I got a house. Come on. You do? Or number a place I stay. Two. Give me number two, dang it! Chaos Combi. To Tails, if you decided to have an assistant, who would it be and why? Probably Omega, because he's way less likely to slip up than anyone else. <laughs> oh, but wait, Tails. If you got any of Eggman's egg pawns in there, then Omega's gonna rage. Oh yes, there will be extermination. He does like to do that. Uh, you know what? I think we're pretty good pals now. I trust him. Knuckles. Four. Super Rouge 5000 mm. S. Two Knuckles. Have you gotten over your quick temper yet? Or do you still snap at everything Sonic says forward slash does? I don't snap at everything he says. I do snap at everything he does, though. <laughs> it's too much fun to provoke him. When he says things, I can just ignore him. But it's when he actually does things, it's infuriating. Last question for speed round. Uh, Knuckles. Uh, three. <laughs> Gentlemen, cool teamable asks to the team, so how many children are you planning to have? What? what? Pass. Mistakes Hard have been pass. made. Negative five. Thank you. Spoiler. Zero. <laughs> How about you, Knuckles? <clears throat> uh, no comment. Let's go ahead and, uh, and and leave the suffering off at that one. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Congratulations. I never, I never want to do that again. All right. All right. We're moving on now. Let's slow the pace and enjoy a little more Christmas cheer with some hot cocoa and another round of holiday questions. Spin the wheel for your question number, Sonic. Ooh, okay, let's do this. Unknown Riddle asks, to Sonic, how would you sort the Ask the Sonic Heroes cast into the naughty and nice list? Ah, that's easy. Uh, Tails, yes! Green, Amy. I haven't really done anything with Guard the Master Emerald. Do you... Do you think maybe I'd be on the nice list? Probably. I don't think uh, there's anything you've done that would put you on the naughty list. Uh, obviously, Eggman in the naughty list, Eggman Nega in the naughty list, Johnny in the naughty list, Jet, Jet in the naughty <laughs> list. Uh, let's see. Rouge, naughty list. What? Yes. <laughs> you know what? No, 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 you know no. What? You take that back. What? Come on, you're a thief. Well, no, she's I... actually, she's she's been behaving lately, <laughs> so I think. I've been a perfect <laughs> angel. <laughs> Shadow, naughty list. Wait, oh. what? Me. I led a slay. Wait, who did you slay? I, no. Again, <laughs> oh this is why he's on the naughty list. I led a slay. Remember? Shadows Rudolph did up. You can't put him on the. Doesn't that like put him on the nice list for like life? This is my list. It's not Stance's list, so. Absolute power will corrupt absolutely. Something has to be done. You're right. Maybe I need to get rid of this list. It's. I have too much power in my hands. Shadow, you take it. Oh, okay. No! no! <laughs> That's gonna be even worse. Well, let me just, uh. We'll just take what you had here and. We'll just start over. <laughs> All right. Uh, number one, Sonic. Wait, what? Because remember that time he was corrupted with power by this very list. Shadow, that was like five minutes ago. And you will forever be doomed for it. Thank you, Shadow. Now you're corrupt. It's not me who's corrupt anymore. He took it. He took it off my hands. Me corrupt. Show you corrupt. Is he okay? <laughs> Is oh, he okay? Turn, Tails. 
From David J. Thompson to Tails, if given the opportunity to work on Santa's sleigh, would you A. Simply repair it, B. Modify it, or C. Help construct a new one? Maybe it's... I, I, I think it's good enough that I don't need to totally rebuild it, you know? But I think it could definitely use some modifications here and there. Oh, and this must be Santa's sleigh. Ho ho ho! Slap Sonic on the side of it, call it the Tornado 3.0. If you wanted to modify the uh, big man's sleigh, I did hear him talking about how he wanted it to be red and black this next year because uh, he was inspired by somebody. <sighs> Don't listen to him, Tails. He's, he's lying. Knuckles, it's time for your question. Okay, here goes. Tiefling Times asks, Two Knuckles, I honestly wonder, how do you spend Christmas, or better yet, winter, on Angel Island? Besides holiday stuff, it's got to get pretty cold. I really don't think a scarf makes up for the lack of pants. Actually, you'd be pretty surprised what a scarf can do. If it's really, it's made with really good material, uh, it's about all I need. Plus, I can, I can figure out ways to keep myself warm. The Master Emerald supplies a certain amount of heat, so it's not too bad. So the Master Emerald is your personal AC. Yes, actually. Excuse me? How does the ventilation work? <laughs> I don't understand. I don't know, man. It, it, it radiates. It radiates. Works wonders, and I don't have to pay anything. Wow. The Master Emerald just gets better and better every time we talk about it. Be careful. You don't want to sell it too much in front of Rouge. Oh, she wouldn't try All to... All I want for Christmas is you. Ooh, baby. No. <laughs> No. Okay, <laughs> last Christmas question for the episode. Let's have you boys spin together this time. Alrighty. <sighs> Scribbles that scream. Oh dear, okay. Oh. <laughs> to everyone, if you had to give a genuine gift to some of your major villains, what would you get them? I'd give Infinite an ugly sweater, so maybe it'll take attention away from that ugly mask. Oh, Merry Christmas. Got him. A genuine gift to give to a villain. I'd give Eggman a razor kit so he could get rid of his mustache. <laughs> That's not a genuine gift. That's pretty I think good. he would hate that. I would like that. <laughs> I'd probably give Eggman a hairbrush. A brush? Here's some grooming materials, <laughs> Eggman. It's funny because he's bald. Yes, that's why. <laughs> that is why. I would give metal an oil change. That's genuine. He really needs an oil change. I mean, at least he's not getting metal a yeah, shaver. Well, what's, what's metal going to do? <laughs> that's a gift that keeps on giving. Riveting responses. Thank you. Enough of that now. Yeah. <laughs> Let's get back to normal for the final round of questions. Next question, please. All right, Faker. <laughs> final question. Bring it on, Faker. Give me number one. Persona 75 asks to Sonic... You can wield a sword. What? <laughs> They're talking about caliber? Sorry, that was... <laughs> what? There was a semicolon, it threw me off. <laughs> I was like, did that break your suspension? Two... Look at that... Shadow? <laughs> yeah. Two Sonic, you can wield a sword. Next question. <laughs> <laughs> Sonic, you can wield a sword. Yes, I can, Shadow. Yes, I can. Okay, thank you for answering. <laughs> Persona 75 asks, Two Sonic, you can wield a sword. How would you fare if you had a one-on-one -on -one sword battle with Sephiroth in Smash? Well, Sephiroth, huh? I think I'd do fairly well enough without a sword. I think with a sword, I'd probably do even better. But if we're talking about him at his full power... What are you doing, Shadow? He's playing one-winged angel in the background. Oh... We're on a budget here. <laughs> the fact that he has that memorized says a lot. Well, I don't know. Maybe I need the Excalibur Sonic to take him on at his full power. I don't know how it'll go from there, but I think I stand a solid chance. Just the hook. Plus, if I use Calibur and my trusty sword by my side, I'm sure we can do anything. I don't know, man. That sword's pretty long. <laughs> hard to reach. <laughs> Guys, take it, taking bets, who do you think would win in a fight between Sephiroth and, uh, and Sonic in a sword fight? The Sephiroth. Yeah, same. Sonic's a dead man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'd be pretty good, I think. If only no. you could bottle and sell that confidence. Mm. That is a really good answer. <laughs> Tails, why don't you pick your last question of the day? 19. 
From God's Little Princess to Tails, I dare you to prank call Eggman, Jet the Hawk, and Infinite simultaneously. Well, I don't think he can get them online simultaneously, but hey, Tails, no. we have some prank <laughs> phone calls. Is there a refrigerator? I'm gonna ask them if their refrigerator's running. Egg <laughs> Eggman, is your stove on? Because you're getting a little fried. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, is this Seymour Butts? <laughs> Have I reached the residence of Seymour Butts? Hello, is this Infinite? I'm looking for an I am weak. I am not home right now. Please leave a message after the <laughs> Tails, are you three-way calling them? Yes. <laughs> oh, okay. Really? Hello? What? Hello? What do you people want? I'm folding my undergarments. Is your refrigerator running? What? <laughs> Who is this? <laughs> That's good. What? It's a normal human activity! <laughs> Who is this? <laughs> got him. <laughs> Hashtag big pranks. Yep, got him! <laughs> He's nuts. Got him. No! <laughs> <laughs> my face hurts. I can't feel my lips or anything in my face. <laughs> very my cheekbones! I can't feel my face when I'm with you. <laughs> no, I hate that song. It's so dumb. <laughs> Knuckles, it's your last question. One through thirty. Twenty. Top Pikmin asks, Sue Knuckles, have you ever thought of training anyone to take your place? I mean, you can't guard the Master Emerald forever, and as of now, you don't have any kind of next of kin to take your place. So, JW. If I can't find a successor, I don't really have anybody in mind at the moment, but if I can't find anybody, then Chaos would just take over. He's basically the gar a guardian of the Master Emerald too. He's here, he just doesn't show up too often unless of something of dire need comes up. If anything, he has the same, he kind of has the same personality as Omega. Do you talk to Chaos in your free time? I can. He doesn't talk that often, but sometimes he does. Dude, what does, he does just his voice like... sound like? Can you yeah, show us? Just... Well, it. Hey Chaos, I know what I... can you talk I know to what... us? I know what I said before about him having a voice, but to be fair, it's, <laughs> exactly. It, it's <laughs> <laughs> How do you understand that? It's kind of like a mental thing. I can hear what he's saying, but it, to everyone else, it's basically what Shadow did. Ah, uh, so like your connection to the Master Emerald. So you're saying it's telepathy. Uh, yes. Does, uh, do, um, Fascinating. does Chaos take it personally whenever I steal the Master Emerald? Because I don't want to get punched by a giant water god guy. Actually, yes, he does. I usually have to calm him down. <gasps> Hi, Chaos! We should become very good friends. Does he get mad if I tap the glass? Yes. Okay. Especially when okay. you tap the glass. Okay, I will And especially when you use flesh photography. <laughs> <laughs> so that's the reason why. No more selfies, Shadow. Put that away. What? No but I've already taken 18. Oh man, then he's coming for us. Oh wow. boy, he's coming. Don't worry, I'll calm him down. I've got this. Knuckles, <laughs> 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 Knuckles, what did he say? He, he said, <clears throat> <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> we was. <laughs> you need a little work there, Shadow. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to see you try. Oh, okay, uh, give me a second. Sonic, don't! You're going to choke! Wait, hold on. <laughs> <laughs> I told you you were going to choke! God. You're not supposed okay. to inhale! That is very tough. <laughs> Shadow, I don't know how you do that. I'm the ultimate. I'll let that one slide this time. We better move on before one of the stars of the show drowns himself. Let's, do, <laughs> let's keep I going. I hear the music already. Oh, God. Oh, no. um, that's Turn not that a good sign, off. buddy. I don't have the insurance to handle this. <laughs> it's okay, I got a one-up. All right, Rouge. Perhaps you should ask the final group question. Yeah, I guess so. Um, I think it circled back to Sonic. Sonic, uh, pick a number one to thirty for the last question of the episode. All right, let's go with number thirty. Number thirty from Relic Fox to the Hero Trio. Taking into account every lady you guys know, name one you would marry, one you uh. would hug, and one you would fire out of a cannon. What? Uh. <laughs> I like this game. I'm scared. Uh. Marry Amy. Ooh. 
Don't take it as I would actually do no this. I would not. Too late now. No take back. Too late now, can't change. No. Yeah, Locked we know in. Sonic wouldn't do this. He's afraid of commitment. Let's <laughs> uh, give Elise a hug. She can do with a hug. And I would fire Eggman's mom. Tails, your turn. Oh. Uh, Mary, hug, cannon. Uh, everybody knows I wouldn't marry Cosmo. Anyway, um, let's let's hug Cream. Um, and this this is really I don't care how stupid this sounds. I'm gonna say it anyway. Let's fire Rouge out of a cannon because she can just fly away, so it's fine. Yo, that'd be cool. You know what? Yeah, and to be fair, we have fired ourselves out of cannons. Before, exactly, so. right? So it's Tails, fine. I'm glad you covered yourself there because I was gonna give you like a knuckle sandwich if you were just gonna no, choose me. No, because up. you could. No, that just makes you fly really high. Isn't that cool? It doesn't have to be a negative thing to be fired out of a cannon, right? Nice say, Tails. No, I'm being <laughs> serious. <laughs> what? Actually, a knuckle sandwich. Rude. Would you just put a piece of bread on knuckle's head? Probably. Sonic. If you don't do it, I'll do it. Sonic, no, you won't. What? You're gonna make his temper snap! Yeah, because you're actually doing it. Don't actually do it. I'll go grab some bread later. Okay, Knuckles, your turn. Mary, uh, hug, cannon! Alright. Mary Rouge, hug Amy, and fire Marine out of a cannon. I win! <laughs> oh and my god. Jeez, sorry, Marine. Marine would probably Savage. enjoy that, though. That's exactly why I said that. <laughs> I think, you know what? You're not wrong, though. I think she would like it, too. <laughs> yeah, knowing her personality. All right, everybody. It looks like that was the last question we had for today. Thank you guys so much for uh, for all of your lovely responses. You're welcome. You are welcome. You're welcome. Hey, Knuckles. Hmm? What's that in your head? See ya. Hey! <laughs> get back here. I always knew you'd make a great Knuckles sandwich. Let me show you another sandwich. Oh. Ooh. This is Rouge the Bat signing out and Merry Christmas! Merry Chrysler! A new year brings a new adventure. But for now, rest easy, heroes. No! You hang up! No, you! No, you! The first one that hangs up should be the one that initiated the prank call! Who did it? Well, it's not me. I'm a good boy. I'm so offended! I can't even! You ingrates! I hope your family gets carried away by ants! <laughs>